So here's the deal with GMOs. Um, we've been modifying organisms for a very long time. It's called hybridization. But we haven't been inserting genes into organisms until a few years ago. There may be good reason to have GMOs if we're trying to feed a world population, but they come with a catch. The catch is usually most of the GMOs have a lectin inserted to make them more pest, more pest resistant, insect resistant. For instance, the GMO tomato and the GMO corn, BT corn, have lectins that are inserted to make them kill insects better. And got news for you, GMO tomatoes and GMO corn will kill you just as well. But the big fear about GMOs is because most of them were developed to handle the insecticide and herbicide Roundup. And it's made by the Monsanto company. It's called glyphosate. And originally it was just to treat GMO plants and kill weeds around the plants and the GMO soybeans and corn would survive. Now, unfortunately, Roundup is sprayed on conventional crops to desiccate them so that they can be harvested. So almost all wheat in this country, almost all corn, almost all soybeans, and almost all canola is actually sprayed with Roundup. And that Roundup is not rinsed off. It's fed to our animals, it's baked into our breads and crackers and cookies, and sadly it's even now appearing in our wines. A recent paper showed that California wines have Roundup in them, and even some organic varieties have Roundup. That's because Roundup has become so widespread. And as you'll find in the plant paradox, Roundup is a killer in so many ways. It changes our bacteria. It changes your ability to make vitamin D. It changes how you handle cholesterol. It even appears in the fetuses of mothers and it appears in kids' urine. This is not safe stuff. That's why GMO got started, but now Roundup is loose and everything. Thanks for watching. Click the circular channel icon to subscribe and make sure you don't miss a single video. Click on the left to watch another great video and don't forget to visit my website for more of my best tips because I'm Dr. Gundry and I'm always looking out for you.